three. What's up, YouTube? Capital G here, DN Dual Commentary. Playing Battery Man, as always. Well, not as always. I might mess around with my Doche. Playing Rich DeWitt, 1586. 1596 for me. Alright, so we took Breakthrough Skill. We got Solemn Warning, uh, Sanctum, Muratek. Uh, well, I don't know why this couldn't be Charger, but it's shitty ass fuel cell, so whatever. <laughs> it's not the, this is obviously not an optimal hand of starting with. Uh, first off, I never want to draw Muratek. Um, I only run, I only run two Muratek's. Yeah, so, like, I, I never, ever, ever want to draw Muratek. Especially considering, um, any Sanctum that I draw now is going to be dead, so. Obviously, I couldn't take the second Sanctum because I would not be able to use it. I just wouldn't. Um, yeah, we'll have to Sanctum that guy. I'm not going to use my Breakthrough skill this early. We'll just go ahead and use Artifact Sanctum on it. I mean, he can Soul Charge, but he'd only be Soul Charging for like one card, so. Like, that's not even that big of a deal. Wow, two Fuel Cells. We're just wasting draw phases like fucking crazy, aren't we? Alright, so we attack for 21. I mean, a 9 volt would be great here, but we're just not getting not getting the cards we need. But, I mean, shit happens, right? Alright, so he activates that end phase Sinister Shadow Games for maybe Falco? That makes the most sense here. Okay, so he does go for Falco. Just get him a face down. <clears throat> Falco for what? <clears throat> and uh, just freaking Squamata is so easy to uh to get into the graveyard in this deck. That makes the deck like it makes the soul charge plays like uber more powerful. One sec, hold on. I'm thinking I might I'm thinking I might solemn warn that card. Because if he goes Goyo, he gets another he gets another monster. Um let's see. If this card is sent from the field, okay, yeah, we're just gonna We're gonna solemn warn that guy. That way at least he doesn't activate the effect. If he has soul charge, it didn't change the position that I was in, it was bad either way. But at least he could, um, what's it called? Okay. I wasn't expecting him to normal summon, but whatever. At least this way he doesn't go plus. Like, he was going to get Goyo either way, so it doesn't matter. Alright. Why did I draw Murtag? Seriously. Okay. Whoops, no, not banish. Alright, so he's got my Muratek. <sighs> Damn, 9 volt. Like, come so fucking late. All right, so nine volt just attacks. During the end phase, he dies. We take some more damage, of course. We draw Forbidden Lance, which doesn't really help. And we just set it. Okay. He summons right in to send hopefully no shadows. Cool, no shadows. Okay. Uh I'm trying to think. Yeah. 
I hate the thought of using the um the lance on the on the Goyo just as like a suicide, but and now we get the storm for Now we get the storm for That is crazy. Yeah, now we get the um the Stormforth, which means it would have been like Wow, we draw double Stormforth. Okay, um, nothing we can do against that, so we'll just attack. And we'll just pass it back to him. Hopefully he can't kill that shit, that'd be, that'd be lovely. Maybe he'll just set a monster. Doesn't Muratek start a new chain? Okay, whatever. You know what? I think that this destruction effect starts a chain too. Okay, that's fine. Watch him have like BLS or something. Or of course, Soul Charge. Ah, of course, Soul Charge. Soul Charge for what? Such a skillful card. Alright, so we see Soul Charge for Raiden. He'll go at least too deep. Okay, so that's 2,000. Okay, 3,000. At least I can't get attacked. Is Raiden once per turn his mill effect? Dragon, okay. Oh, yeah, double dragon. Awesome. Oh, yeah, okay. You can only use Raiden once per turn. Great. I'm thinking he might go scrap dragon on me and just blow up my monster in exchange for his riding. I mean, that makes a lot of sense. I was thinking maybe he'd go 101. Okay, he goes spark dragon. That's kind of a problem. One, two draw so we're in a pretty good position um, mainly just because he didn't put anything else on the board so all right yeah um and that position basically I was able to tribute for my second fuel cell and then obviously I had industrial strength. I was a little concerned that he would get rid of my monster, but the fact that he left my monster on board made it I mean made it better because um well you know what? I just drew the per I just drew the, the right combination of cards. There's there's really no me like trying to explain. I, I kinda had the right combination of cards. Alright, so Against this version of Shadows, the like the level four version with all the dragons and stuff, um, Shadow Mirror isn't like the greatest card, but I kind of like Max C's in this matchup, uh, mainly because they this deck relies on. Um, I feel like this version of Shadows relies on special summoning so much, and I feel like they rely on um, what's that card? I feel like they really really rely on Soul Charge, so. You can capitalize basically on Maxi, which I don't really like Maxi in general against Shadows, but again, I like it against this specific version.
Damn, dude, I opened with um, Call of the Haunted. I even sided that shit out. Alright, so he mills two. Nothing good. And he'll mill two more. I think he mills two and not three. Alright, so he gets a free monster. And a super poly. So he still has six cards. I wonder what he'll go for. He'll probably go for Dragon. Yeah, he'll probably go for Dragon. No, he went for Squamata. That's interesting. Nine Volt would be great here. Because <laughs> I could just attack over that motherfucker. And I wouldn't have to commit anything else. Like, I wouldn't have to really commit much to get rid of uh, Raiden. Like, I wouldn't have to rely on using Sanctum. Um, I get Honest, which... Whatever. Alright, so we'll set... I think four in this situation. And... We'll go Sanctum. See if that's good. I mean, I can't have this dude milling a bunch of cards. The more cards he mills, the more chances uh, he has of basically hitting good cards. So, <laughs> Again, um, Whistle Call would have been perfect in that situation. 9-Volt instead of Honest, because 9-Volt would have gotten me a Tribute. It would have killed Raiden. I could have sat on my Sanctum. It, it would have loaded me for Call of the Haunted. I mean, it would have... <laughs> It would have turned this hand into just the butt to just greatness. Like, it would have done so much for this hand. Um, so he super polys. Okay, there's so nothing we can do about that, I guess. Alright, he goes for Dragon. Hopefully he goes for Call of the Haunted. Oh, no. Well, there goes that. And he has Soul Charge as well. Even better. He just says everything. Oh wow, he goes for four monsters. Put your dragon in attack mode. Not really sure why. I believe he used dragon this turn already. Chaos Sorcerer and another Raiden. He's going to synchro for eight. Rap Dragon. Uh, let's see. I'm not sure if he's used Beast already this turn. Okay, then we'll take out Beast. I don't even know if this dude plays Felgran. I honestly don't think he does. Okay, so he just sets one. Evac that chick. Is that your chick? Oh, man, come on. Maybe I shouldn't even decide it in the crossouts. If I could just get a tribute monster, that'd be great. Okay, so he has super poly. I guess that's what he's saying. Um, 
Okay. <laughs> All right, so he had Vanity's Emptiness. Um, if he didn't have Vanity's Emptiness, I would have went in on him, obviously. But he did have it, so whatever. I strong. I really believe he has Super Poly Set. Like, there's no reason that you just normal summon a Falco like that if you don't have Super Poly Set. Okay. So we'll just attack. <sighs> I mean, there, there, there really isn't much that I could do in this situation. You could say that I can blind MST. Like, I don't even know what the point of that would be. To avoid the super poly, I guess. Now, if he doesn't do anything this turn, then yeah, I'll probably blind MST him. This would be great if I had what's it called? That's super poly. Told you. So now we're just trying to run the gauntlet through um, basically all these little fucking bitch ass floating dragons. <laughs> if I got a nine volt again, that'd be great because that'd have been game. But I can't seem to draw another monster. I run three nine volts and three micro cells, and I am not drawing these motherfuckers at all. Like we are not drawing them. He's obviously looking for a shadow. Okay, so we hit dragon. We're going to attempt to attack for game, and we got it. Wow. I'm shocked that we got that game. Mainly just because I didn't, I wasn't drawing any monsters. He had Vanities and MST. And obviously he had the, um, the what's it called? Obviously he had the, the, um, the, the last dragon in hand, which I, I was kind of surprised that he didn't summon it. It was his last one, but I still thought he was going to summon it regardless. Anyways, thank you guys for watching as always.